Good morning. Today is April 24th, 2021. It's a Saturday and today I am heading out to Jay Cook State Park. Gonna go do some backpacking with some girlfriends, stay overnight and in the backpacking site and we were not expecting this weather. I don't know if you can see, but we got some snow, we got some rain. Uh, I had to switch up my gear for this trip. was planning on going a lot lighter, but uh, it's going to be, I think, 20, let's see, 24, 27 for the low. We'll see how low it gets here, but so I had to switch things up, but I'm ready to rock and roll. I got my backpack all packed up and um, I'm at 31.8 pounds, so I've been training at 32 pounds, so should be should be fine. I think I got everything. I hope I got everything. So see you on the trail. Well, I'm back here at my house. I got all the way to Harris, which is probably about, I don't know, maybe, maybe 15 minutes away north uh, of 35 there. And as I'm driving up there, I thought, man, did I bring my shoes? I'm wearing rain boots and, uh, I know I brought my shoes into the kitchen and I set them on the counter and so anyways I pulled over in Harris and looked in the back they're not there they're not up here so had to turn around so back home all right so we made it I made it up to, to Jay Cook and there's a group of people already here it's like a big group it'll be fun it's not quite as cold as I thought it was. Everybody's all packed up. Some people are camping here, like I am. Some people are just hiking. Did you get one? I know. Oh. <laughs> okay. I don't have the map on me, so somebody with the map. There's a blue thing. I, I have the map, but I don't know how to use it here. <laughs> yeah. so, what trailer are we doing? Okay. Are we doing the hiking loop? Or? I'm not sure. Oh. Yeah. We're following the FHG. That's what we're doing. Okay. We're following that. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Is that what we're doing? <laughs> She's worried I'm going to kill her out here. I think she's going to kill her. <laughs> A little bit of rocks and roots here. You know you're on the SHT when you see rocks and roots. Exactly.
Just keep posing. Yeah. Yes, yes, no, no. Work it. Florida and brought them. Okay, we're, we're three miles in and we're stopping. Are you filming right now? Yeah. <laughs> and I'm dying. Because <laughs> this pack does not feel like 31.8 pounds. Pretty though. It is. I want to grow up with you. Cliche to say, but it's true. Tell me you see me just as I see you. All right, so. We are headed back to our campsite. We did not get to the Southern Terminus because it was like an extra, extra mile that I didn't realize on the map. So we're too tired, getting too late. We did about 5.3 miles so far. And so now we're heading to our campsite, which is a silver backpacking site in Jay Cook. Sun's out. We had a little snack, had a rest, we're good to go. Your secrets It's time to let our guard down I can promise you anything But loving you, loving you tonight I want to grow All right, we made it to our campground. Here we are. <laughs> we made it. Woo! Woo! There you go. That's awesome. Okay, we're at the campsite and I am filling up my water. So I just want to show you this really pretty, I mean, really awesome. We, have, we really lucked out for the campsite. It's gorgeous. So it's about 6.30 and we are setting up for dinner. Everybody's sharing food. I'm hungry. Um, it's starting to cool off here. So we'll get hunkered down and I believe Gretchen's going to start a fire for us. So. tannins in this water so it's always going to have that yellow color to it but we'll get that filtered and be good to drink Gretchen what are you doing? I am cooking us a delicious dinner with fresh ramps from the forest they don't know where we are yeah <laughs> you cut that part out yeah <laughs> So what do you, you're going to boil them? And... Yeah, so I'm going to blanch them and they just cook down like uh, spinach. I was making them smaller now because when they cook down they're going to be like 
pot. Let's see, it's hard to cook. Okay. Right, cut. Cook. Or cut, yeah, sorry. Yes, that's a good idea. Yeah, I had a good moment there. Right. Okay, so what does everybody have for dinner? Ugh. What you got there? Three cheese mac and cheese in a bag. Okay. I don't know. Well, yeah, you see, but you, put leeks in you it, did you share mean. some really did delicious snacks. Lots of food. <laughs> so we're not going to You just call me up, see what you want. <laughs> what do you have? Shepherd pie made up garlic mashed potatoes and chicken. This is some really random good. pasta good. stuff yeah. that I mm -hmm. don't know. You still don't know what it is? <laughs> <laughs> Once it's done, I might. <laughs> All right. And I have, what do I? I have some soup yeah. and potatoes and probably lots of other stuff. Yes. run out of sticks and it sucks. Oh, and then you just use more fire starters. I've never done that before last night. <laughs> <laughs> he does exactly what I do. <laughs> For sure. I'm like blowing on it, blowing up. Oh, look at I got like the golden hour right now too. Yeah, nice. you do. Get a good, a good, a good one ever. We're all just like sitting here watching Gretchen do all her work. Yeah. It's the Gretchen show. <laughs> it's okay. She seems to not be bothered yeah, by no, it I know. at all. I like teaching stuff, so it's fun. It's fun to like you share just my be skills. A teacher. I'm not hateful to her, so. I do too. She's I starting have, already. I have that <laughs> second time. <laughs> This time in my face. Like she got you. Oh. You want to sit? I've saved you a spot right over here. She's like, I can't do it. <laughs> Text to Nicole. Okay, I gotta get a better view. Yeah, yeah, yeah get, get a view of all of us yeah, not working. Yeah. <laughs> That's great. We're whispering so you don't get us. Okay, we're live now, so go ahead and tell us what Welcome you're doing. Welcome to Fire Making with Gretchen. Today. <laughs> Okay, so you scrape, okay. scrape, scrape, scrape. You're getting that dust in there. It's hard to see. You got my dust in there. So there's a little pile of dust. I'm going to scrape Pharaoh in. So I'm scraping that off. Oh, don't start yet. Very, very happy to go. Okay, so there's my little. Okay, and then. That's amazing. I'm going to do this to my husband and tell him what a badass I am. Good one. Oh. These aren't going to kids, are they? <laughs> I know, right? The world is going to see this. The whole world. Gretchen's going viral. My finger. Is this still gone? Nope. <clears throat> I need like more dust. These, this, uh, this birch bark is. I want to go grab that birch bark this? up there. No, you know what I'm going to do? I want to do it this cool way because it's fun. You're going to climb up there to that one? Did you, can... did you really cut yourself? Do you need a band aid? No, it's fine. It's just a little. Okay. She's going to climb a tree, too. Look at her. She's Why don't you just do the downed one over next to her? There it? she goes. Look at her go. Okay. I'm glad she's in our group. She is <laughs> serious <laughs> about this fire making business. Look at her go. <laughs> I have a feeling when we're actually hiking. We're just coming up. Okay, here she comes. She's got a birch. Yeah, as I said, I wasn't going to trip oh, over that. Oh, shoot. I'm sorry. If anyone trips on there, we shouldn't. you shouldn't yeah. be out here. That's what she said. <laughs> yeah. I didn't now you're running off. I cut myself, too. It's not bleeding anymore, but... I'm real special like that. Okay, so if you don't know about birch bark, you can take off the top layer here, and we won't kill the tree all the way around. Mm -hmm. So that's what they made birch bark canoes out of and stuff. But this fresh stuff is a little easier. Save that. Okay, so. I wish I had a set to do it. <laughs> I know, me too. Can we do a, like, just a car camp trip where we just learn all the things? Yeah. That could be awesome. Can tell we could do the backpacking bees. How many really Saturdays when you say yes to this do you have left, Gretchen? <laughs> What's that? How many Saturdays do you <laughs> have? One. Yeah. <laughs> Literally one. I know. That's what I told I have none this summer. I have a whole month. All right. I so I'm going to take... I'm getting not going to spill my pile. <laughs> I have all of July. No. July most of August. Okay. Take two. But like now the black stuff's done, so what happens yeah. next time? So what, you keep going off. It's not the black stuff. Oh. That's just a coating. Oh, I didn't know that either. So you can see it's still, see the little coils? Yeah. Duh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know how to say the word. I, heard the I thought it was the black stuff too. I did. I was thinking you're going to have to buy me a new I one. I know, though. I was like, no, <laughs> the whole food. These, the these you'll see like really used ones will have like a curve point and you can actually use this all the way down to nothing. Oh. So these last a long time if you care for them. 
Usually you'll lose them before you use them all. If you care for them. How do you care for them? Okay. Not lose them. Oh. <laughs> you know, there's several people on Lost that had to get off of Lost know, because they lost their feral rod. That one guy, the yeah. first day, he put it in the fire. Put it on a chain and then not take it off? Like, wear like a necklace. They left it, but he left it right, right there yeah. and it like washed up in the, the shore. The first day. Oh. Yeah, in the yeah. sand? Yeah. yeah. I thought for sure that guy was going to go through to the end. I was like super excited and then he, I know. Do all the he did that and I was like, oh. lost that. I don't even know what you're talking about. Have you seen the show Lost? Go no, watch alone, it. Alone. Oh, alone. alone. Yeah. Alone. Yeah. Alone. I was thinking. Where, Where do you find it? <laughs> you alone. didn't even need the fat and, stick. Um, no. Oh, that's not too loose. Yeah. yeah. I just got done watching all the seasons in a week. <laughs> I think season six is on Netflix. It is. Oh, oh I don't God, know. that smells so good. It does. I watched all Look of them. Look at us, alone. you guys. Speak of the fire. Us. Look at us, you guys. <laughs> Look at us. Kitchen's over there like... No, us. Um, uh, I don't know. She's kind of botching it. No, no. No, that's. <laughs> that's this is, is why sweet. you have all this ready. To like, go. Awesome. Yeah. Do you know what I would have done? Like, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> now what do I do? I'm just grabbing this stuff, throwing it. Mm. Oh, Gretchen, you are oh, like the you're hero. So you are the hero. <laughs> you guys, I feel like a million bucks right now. You are. <laughs> uh, yeah. You are like a celebrity, and look at us. They're all watching you. It's like. Yeah. And so this is good too because the birch bark will burn even when it's wet. So then if you have mm. slightly wet sticks, you can put a big pile on and it will dry them as it's starting the fire. And then once you have big enough sticks, you can burn wet stuff. Hmm. So. so my fire starters under my logs were not the best plan. <laughs> 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 once you learn how to do it with birch bark, you could start, or that green uh, reindeer moss. Oh, yeah. That grows all over. You can start a fire in the middle of winter when everything's covered in ice. See, that's what I don't know. Yeah, so we need, we do need you to teach a class. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Anyway, yeah. I'm going to go get it. It doesn't even have, it's just like a couple of hours, like yeah. we all meet somewhere. So you guys and... think that trick is cool? Yeah. I can do it with real flint and steel, mm. like a chunk of metal and I'll start with a, like a piece oh. of flint and char cloth. And I can start, I win the competitions against guys all the time because that's what I do when I rendezvous. It's, it's primitive camping. It's but I, I'm only doing one this year actually, and we're going out in Gary, South Dakota. So so it's basically body. muzzle loader clubs There's that Nicole. permanent camp because you, it just goes together. Gretchen, even Shira. Yes. We'll do the little wet. Mm. Wait for a little bit because I was able to buy her a whole bunch of shoes. <laughs> <laughs> Flip them over. All right, I'm away from the campsite here. I want to take a little video and uh, show you what we got. It was a rough night last night. Not because it was cold, it was just super uncomfortable, but frost, a lot of condensation, but stayed pretty warm. Gretchen, Gretchen's waking up. <laughs> oh yeah, they're frozen, frozen. <laughs> they're checking things off the fresh down there. Take a walk down there today.
I made it through the night and woke up to this beautiful, peaceful campsite with the babbling brook still going strong. Last night was a pretty interesting sleeping. Um, I wasn't super cold. It was a little bit cold at first. I did kind of have some chills, but then I must have warmed up because I was fine pretty much the rest of the night. But I really only got three hours, of sl about three hours of sleep. Um, just my legs were cramping up. I did not drink enough water yesterday on the hike. And then when I got back, I didn't drink any water before bed because I, I don't want to get up to go pee, which I went up to go pee twice anyways. So in the big picture, it probably wouldn't have mattered. I probably would have just gone the twice anyways, but um, so I didn't really get a lot of sleep because of that. I was sleeping on a new sleeping pad last night that was really noisy also. It was it had that papery sound, so it was pretty noisy, um, which I was worried was going to bother the other campers, but apparently it didn't, so that's good. Um, and I did toss and turn a lot, so um, hopefully I didn't disturb them too much, but... Uh, this morning, because of the colder temps, everything had frost on it and everybody had condensation in their tent, including me, which is a little disappointing because mine is a three to four season tent. And I was thinking maybe, because it does have three layers in some areas. So I was thinking maybe that wasn't going to be an issue, but no, everything is pretty soaked in there. It's pretty damp. So sleeping bag and my rumple and everything, my clothes are all pretty damp so um my water filter was not frozen this morning i just had it inside the tent i didn't sleep with it and my phone's working fine i did sleep with my phone so um so i think i did pretty well i also had the nalgene in my um the nalgene bottle in my sleeping bag with boiling water put that in and that was great i'm gonna do that next time i'll probably bring two next time um because i would have liked one on my lower back but I did have it by my feet and it, it kept my feet warm all night. I didn't have cold feet at all. So so that was a good tip that I learned. Um, so now the plan today is to eat breakfast. Um, which the girls are back at the campsite. They're making their breakfast. I think Gretchen might start a fire again. I'm not sure. But... Um, I just made some coffee. I got a double dose of uh, Starbucks Instant the Via and Carnation Instant Breakfast Vanilla. So it's pretty good, actually. I'm pretty happy with it. But of course, anything tastes good on the trail. So, um, and then we're gonna head out and head back to the parking lot. We we thought about doing the hiking loop, and maybe we will, but I doubt it. <laughs> it's about three miles back to the parking lot and then the hiking trail is another three miles so I think three miles is probably good enough for the day uh, my feet are sore my ankles are sore um, so I'm thinking maybe I might get some new inserts for my shoes I think it might be time anyways so but yeah right now I'm just gonna enjoy the beautiful morning and the peace it's great out here
get by us. I don't think we're going to be able to get by them. But we're going to try. Already leaving. I'm waiting for the girls. They're at the bridge. So I'm gonna get them crossing the bridge. <laughs> 